What's the status of your relationship with Shane now? I have only just been tested with one gender thus far, but he's never seen me with the other gender. Well, okay. we have got two very nice ladies. Okay. Okay. Who are going to be joining us this right. evening. What the hell? What are the odds of that? Damn, these two are good. They are specifically coming... Right. ..for you. OK. <laughs> For God's sake. OK. Yeah. Their names are Lauren and Takesha, and it's going to be the diner, OK, with drinks. And then at the end of the night, if you've liked any of the ladies, you can make a decision on whether one of them will move in or not. OK. Wowza. Much Thank love. you. Right, I'm sure I'll see you very soon. Can't wait oh, to yeah. find out. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, guys. Goodbye. Good Take care. Goodbye. Bye. Hello. Hi. Oh, my God. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you, you Ben. Nice. Are you OK? I'm Kimberly. Nice to meet you. Hello, Alison. Hi. Hi. Lovely to meet you. you. I'm Lauren. Lauren, nice Walking to meet you, Lauren. You. Hi. You OK? Yeah, you. Yeah, yeah sure. good. Nice to meet you both. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. When I first moved into the mansion, if Paul and Anna had told me that I was going on a date with two girls, I'd be absolutely buzzing. But let's be real, I do have feelings for Shane, so I don't know what's going to happen next. Crack on then, Kimbers, your first date awaits. Hi, my name's Takesha. I am 25 years old. I'm from Bedfordshire. I am going to hopefully go into the house to maybe find somebody who doesn't really take themselves too seriously. How long have you been single for? Not that long, but I'm always in a relationship, so it's quite oh, nice. Yeah. That, yeah, I've had this time to myself, but I do prefer being with somebody. What about you? I've been single for two years. And obviously at 33, I'm starting to think, like, I do yeah. definitely want to yeah. meet someone and start spending mm -hmm. my life with someone. And... Like, are you bi? Again? I'm bi. bi yeah. yeah, I've been yeah. bi for 10 years. I don't see gender, like... Yeah, no, that's the same as me, all. really. Yeah. I want to be honest with you, mm. yeah? Yeah, yeah. Um, and honest with myself, I kissed somebody for the first time yesterday. Music to any new date's ears. Not knowing this, yeah, by the way, yeah. like, it was going to happen. Yeah. But I would have done it regardless, because... You just do what you got to do, have not Ten days in, like, I was like, right, I'm, mm. I'm actually ready to, to, to kiss somebody. Are you happy where it's going? Yeah, I am. But I suppose my question to you would be, like, if you were to be in the house, how would that feel to you. That's right, Kimbers, cut to the chase. I mean, I'm such a chilled person, like, nothing really phases me that much. You, you've got to do what you got to do, you've got to find out like, yeah. how you feel about situations. So, yeah, yeah, definitely. I'm, I'm cool about it. That's good. Good job to Keisha, as something tells me Kimberly's mind may be elsewhere. Right, top up that Asti Spumanti as it's back to the diner and date number two for Kimberly. Hi, my name's Lauren, I'm 26, I'm an influencer and I live in London. Um, I'm looking for the agent's Cupid Love help to find me somebody who is ambitious and driven. What do you do? Um, I'm an influencer, fashion blogger. What? Yeah. So you're yeah. a fashion influencer? Yeah, yeah, I've been doing it full time now for three years. Mate, I'm li literally the worst person. No, you're not, Kimberly. You're lovely. Be kind to yourself. On Instagram. I think if it wasn't my job, I'd probably be the same. Because it's so, like, you can spend hours on it. And it's always there, like, in my hand all the time. Like, it never ends. Yeah. So, if you don't mind me asking, are you, are you gay? Are you bad? Um, yeah, no, I am gay. I actually only came out, like, two and a half, three years ago. The boys were pretty excited about me, the, the prospect of me coming on a date with two girls yeah, tonight. Yeah, I can imagine. They, they were, were like, pretty <laughs> excited. I bet they wish there was a little peephole. Don't give them any ideas. <laughs> Whilst we're on the topic of who's in the house, just to let you know that at the mm. minute I'm, I'm currently um, yeah. exploring my options with one person. Yeah. Oh, here we go. You might as well be setting the booth with you. I really do like them, mm -hmm. but I am absolutely in this system and of dating for me yeah. and to, f to be selfish, actually. Is that why you keep talking about Shane? You're I mean, and you're allowed to be like, Christ, everyone's here for you, honey, so don't you worry. You I, take your it bit. feels like a weird <laughs> thing to be in that yeah, position where course, you're like, yeah, yeah. anything goes. Yeah, well, I love Hello! Back, baby. Back, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so grateful to Paul and Anna for sending girls in. I really absolutely needed that. It's been so man-heavy, I needed the women in there too. I'm buzzing. It's been a positive experience. OK, decision time for Kimbers. It's a toughie. I wonder how this is going to go. So, I think because last night I had my first kiss with the person in 10 days, I have to stick by my gun with him, stand by my gut and my heart at the minute. And I really do fancy you both. It's bad. <laughs> it is bad. So, for that reason, I, I just think I 
I couldn't walk in the house with another person right now. No, that's fair that's enough. Fine. Is that all right? Yeah, of course. I wouldn't want to make you feel yeah, like, no. awkward about anything. But yeah. like, he's going to be gassed when you walk in with no one. Right now, it's him. No, it that's has fine. To be. No, but I'm happy for you. Thank <laughs> you so much, babe. Thank you so much, Very genuinely. Much. And yeah. thank you for coming. Let's check back in with Kimberly, who's found Shane to spill the tea. Do you want to know about my night? I really do. Do you actually? Yeah. Right, so, I get in the room, there's two girls there, I'm going a three-way date. No, not like that, Shane. I won't lie to you, there was one girl that I would have loved to have snogged. Mm-hmm. But... <laughs> Ultimately, at the end of the date, I was like, there's no way that I'm going to mess with what I've got for a potential something. Like, you are the person that I'm thinking about constantly and, like, what be around. And the thought of remotely hurting you or making you feel insecure and you're not enough is not worth the risk for me right now. Feeling is better and I feel something for you. So I said no. And they both went home. I really like that. We're in a good, good place. Very good place. I'm really happy. I think it's going to take a big force to reckon with us right now. Definitely. Yeah? Yeah. You having it? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. They're having it and we're bloody mm -hmm. loving it. Yeah.